In this video, I'm going to show you seven super simple Arduino projects that are perfect for beginners. These projects are easy to understand and require minimal components, making them ideal for those just starting out with Arduino. The best part is that all of these projects can be completed in under an hour, so you'll be able to see results quickly and stay motivated. So let's get started. Project 1. Arduino Hello World. This is the classic first project for any Arduino. The goal is to make the Arduino board say Hello World on the serial monitor. To do this, we'll use the built-in LED on the Arduino board. First, connect the positive side of a resistor to the 5 volt pin and the negative side to the digital pin 13. Then connect the positive side of the LED to the other side of the resistor and the negative side to ground. Now we can write a program that will turn the LED on and off to spell out Hello World. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the LED start blinking in the serial monitor. You've just made your first Arduino project. Project 2. Arduino Digital Read and Write. In this project, we'll use a breadboard and jumper wires to read and write to a digital pin. First, connect a push button to the breadboard with the positive side connected to the positive side of the power supply and the negative side connected to a digital pin on the Arduino. Now connect the other side of the push button to the Arduino's ground pin. Now we can write a program that will read the state of the push button and turn the built-in LED on when the button is pressed. To do this, we'll use the built-in LED on the Arduino board. First, connect the positive side of a resistor to the 5 volt pin and the negative side to the digital pin 13. Then connect the positive side of the LED to the other side of the resistor and the negative side to ground. Now we can write a program that will read the state of the push button and turn the LED on when the button is pressed. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the LED turn on when you press the push button. Project 3, Arduino PWM. In this project, we'll use a servo motor to demonstrate PWM. First, connect the servo motor to the Arduino board with the positive side connected to the 5 volt pin, the negative side connected to the ground pin, and the signal wire connected to a PWM pin on the Arduino. Now we can write a program that will make the servo motor rotate back and forth. To do this, we'll use the built-in servo library. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the servo motor move back and forth. Project 4. Arduino I2C. In this project, we'll use an I2C display to show how to read from and write to I2C devices. First, connect the I2C display to the Arduino board with the positive side connected to the 5 volt pin and the negative side connected to the ground pin. Also connect the SDA and SCL pins to the I2C pins on the Arduino board. Now we can write a program that will display Hello World on the I2C display. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the text appear on the display. Project 5, Arduino SPI. In this project, we'll use a shift register to demonstrate SPI. First, connect the shift register to the Arduino board with the positive side connected to the 5 volt pin and the negative side connected to the ground pin. Also connect the SCK, MISO and MOSI pins to the SPI pins on the Arduino board. Now we can write a program that will make the built-in LED on the shift register blink. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the LED start blinking. Project 6, Arduino Ethernet. In this project, we'll use an Ethernet shield to connect to the internet and retrieve data from a website. First, connect the Ethernet shield to the Arduino board. Now we can write a program that will connect to the internet and print the current time to the serial monitor. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the current time appear in the serial monitor. Project 7, 
Arduino Wi-Fi. In this project, we'll use a Wi-Fi module to connect to a Wi-Fi network and send data to a web server. First, connect the Wi-Fi module to the Arduino board with the positive side connected to the 5 volt pin and the negative side connected to the ground pin. Also connect the module's TX and RX pins to the Arduino's TX and RX pins. Now we can write a program that will connect to a Wi-Fi network and send the data to a web server. When you upload the code to the Arduino board, you should see the data appear on the web server. These are just a few simple Arduino projects that are perfect for beginners. If you want to learn more about Arduino, check out the link below for a full course that will teach you everything you need to know to get started with Arduino. Thanks for watching and happy Arduining!